Hey, how's it going everybody? Scott Spritzer here, DocSports.com. Welcome to the update for Saturday, March 20th, 2021, free pick in college basketball. Big dance action coming up on this report. First quick note, if you've yet to become a member at DocSports.com, just want to give it a trial run, click on that link below the video, get set up for a free $60 account, which you can then use on any of my daily packages or anybody else on the roster at DocSports.com. Again, get started by clicking on the link below the video. All right, we headed to Saturday over the last three nights, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, and the tourneys, 75% against the spread with our premium plays. Our free and premium plays have combined to hit 83%, five, one, and one. And we cashed our biggest play thus far, which was yesterday, biggest play of the big dance, six-star blowout win. Nice second half out of the Arkansas Razorbacks. We've got our highest rated play so far uh, this last few days of the big dance in the NIT. Going on Saturday, it is a big dance play. It's an afternoon side. It's a seven-star main event. First one of the tourneys, and it is available on my homepage at DocSports.com. Seven-star main event, multiple game card in college basketball, big dance action on Saturday. Uh, we expect to win both. We expect to win here, and if we do, we'll be 8-1-1 one, and one with free and premium plays since Wednesday in college basketball. You know about the long term run going all the way back to late November. My college basketball side's up almost $6,000 for $100 per unit betters. And again, the seven-star play leads the way on Saturday. Highest rated play so far in the big dance. Also, we've got a five-star play in Saturday night's NBA. 67% NBA run that began before the All-Star break. I've got a four-star play in the NHL. We are up over $2,600 the last three weeks in the NHL. And uh, we passed yesterday in soccer, but we are back with a four-star play in Saturday soccer action. We are up over $4,000 since February 1st in soccer for $100 per unit betters. A lot going on. One more sport to tell you about. Last weekend, we swept our FCS college football. Perfect 2-0. Hit a six-star blowout winner with VMI. I've got my first seven-star play in FCS football action this spring. Going on Saturday, it is a day game, so check it out if you wish. We'll look to win again after last week's sweep. All right, uh, let's get to it. College basketball action. Texas lay at eight and a half over Abilene Christian, and this line has come down on a few books. We're fine with that because we power rated Texas 11 and a half points better than Ab Christian in this particular matchup, and I'm going to stick with that rating. The Longhorns clicking at both ends of the floor. If you've been watching this team, they're a tad undervalued. Remember that stretch back in January when they had COVID protocol in Austin and they had to miss 10 days of action? Well, they were rolling. Then they came back and they lost three straight. They lost a real close one point nail biter to Oklahoma. They did lose by 14 to Baylor. Then they lost a double overtime to Oklahoma State. That three game skid kind of took Texas off the map, so to speak, for teams to contend for a final four appearance when everybody was just, you know, all over this team before the COVID protocol break. Now that they're back, they got their legs under them. They looked really good, obviously, in the Big 12 tournament. They've won five in a row. Now, both of these teams have strong uh, defensive numbers, but Abilene Christian did it against the 327th ranked strength of schedule. The thing I like about this game that sets up well for Texas, besides the fact I think they're being undervalued by three points, is that Abilene Christian has scored 75 or more points in 12 of the last 13 games. They are going to look to score. That plays into what the Longhorns want to do best, the sharpshooting Longhorns, I should say, and I expect Texas to win by a spread covering margin. So, going to recommend a play, an opinion on Texas, minus the points over Abilene Christian. Christian on Saturday. Don't forget, first seven-star main event of the college basketball big dance is a Saturday afternoon play, and it's available on my homepage over at DocSports.com. If you like the videos, click on the thumbs up button. Be sure to subscribe. I'm Scott Sprites or DocSports.com. Let's put Saturday in the win column right back here late Saturday night with Sunday's report.